It wasn't until the late 70s when rap went mainstream. But before then, the pioneers of hip hop showed off their skills in the Bronx, giving birth to music that still influences today's culture. Hip hop is freedom. It's freedom to be who I am. It's freedom for me to be able to express um, my thoughts, my opinions, um, unapologetically. The evolution of hip hop is important to a group of University of Delaware students who decided to take people on a journey through exhibits and some dance performances. Hey. Though this scene looks like one big party, the goal, according to Edward Franklin of UD's Cultural Advisory Board, is to educate students often misinformed about the music. Hip-hop has been an integral part of, I would say, the African-American community for over the past 40 years. Um, it's been able to connect to a bunch of different political and social uh, justice injustices, and it's something that our students connect to. To further connect students, every decade in hip-hop is represented. From the 70s to the 2000s, several things here, like these old vinyl records, are just synonymous with hip-hop. Everything we do in this time uh, is influenced by the past, um, so 90s is really big for this time period for us. The visual exhibit definitely caught the attention of one student who says he was drawn to hip-hop at an early age. I'm a lover of hip-hop. Um, hip-hop really raised me alongside my parents. Um, I grew up in Lagos, Nigeria, but I discovered hip-hop at a very young age. Um, and you know, you know, as an adolescent, you know, male, growing up, learning a lot of values, you know, um, you could either be, you know, straight one way or straight the other. And I think hip-hop was there. Obi even names a few of his all-time favorites. We can take it back and say KRS-One. We can talk about the Outkast. We can even talk about the Sugar Hill Gang, really. Everything in between. As for what time period students enjoyed the most, it was a tie between two decades. I've had fun doing the 70s and 80s just because researching the fashion and the trends that were going on during that time, it really shows how our trends in fashion have, haven't have changed much and we can I, can I have witnessed where it may have started. However, some question whether or not hip hop is headed in the right direction. It's a bit different now. It still serves its purpose, which is primarily for people to be able to express themselves and to be able to use their voice. The message has just changed over time, and I would say it's probably a big contributor is, you know, the life and the day and age that we're currently in today. And if these students can help it, hip hop is here to stay.